Hey guys, Austin here, and welcome to another Lucky Block Challenge video. And today, folks, we will be fighting the Fire Cow from the Elemental Cows mod. Now, if you're wondering, I just did review this mod, so if you want to find out the download for this mod or what this mod is basically about, go check it out. But basically, to summarize the entire thing, it's basically cows that do amazing abilities and shoot lightning and all kinds of junk. But um, today, we're going to be fighting the Fire Cow, so... Yep, fire cow for the win. And to be fighting him, we are going to be using an iron pickaxe, a crafting table, and 30 lucky blocks. Yes, I know 30. So this is our first official boss we're fighting. It has around 100 health. I do believe so. And like I said, it's pretty OP. And normal um, diamond swords don't do much damage on this thing because its defense is too OP. So we have actually some trades for once. So if I get an iron block, I will get a sharpness 5 diamond sword, which is 13.25 attack damage. And if I get a block of gold, I will get a power 5 bow. No errors, though. The errors must be found in the lucky blocks. So... We're going to start off with opening our, these 30 lucky blocks, so let's get started. Listen to me. F listen to me, Destroyer. You are in grave danger. You need to run now. Take this mushroom and run. It is your only hope. No. I'll be a rebel. Okay. Oh, unlucky pot. I'm actually going to keep this. I might actually need that. Um, we have a diamond axe. If I somehow get no weapon, I'm using that. Um, what is, is this a lucky hoe? Lucky hoe. I don't need this. Oh, oh yeah, in case you guys didn't know, fun fact, 1.9, you know, the update that's never going to come out. Um, Once it does come out, hoes will actually have attack damage. So possibly, in the lucky, this lucky hoe may actually have like 5 attack damage in the future. Who knows? Um, TNT, nah, I don't trust it. Um, cake, I'm actually kind of hungry right now, so I'm just going to do that. Um, more gold tools, where's all like the, there we go. I was going to say, where's all like the armor and stuff, I'm only getting like tools and stuff. End portal frames, don't want. Um, trap, I don't want that I'm killing myself because I'm not waiting. Um, we're almost halfway through this and we're not getting anything. <laughs> a ton of a ton of um, guardian temple stuff, don't need that. A ton of die that lagged me for some reason, don't want that. Okay, I don't want you. You know what, I'm just not going to deal with you. You're going to peaceful. Goodbye. And I'm going to keep this on easy today because these cows are too OP. Um... Rose, no, or Poppy, whatever. Oh, Emerald Block. I'm going to take this for absolutely no reason because I have no types of mods installed that can possibly transfer emeralds into Bob. I should probably kill Bob, but um, I'm nowhere near... Sh I don't have anything good enough to kill him. Oh, Witch and Bob. Just great. Um, Okay, we have some stone tools. What's with all the tools? Great. No, you're not killing me. I win. I'm taking this fish because I'm probably going to need said fish. I'm just killing the witch now. Die, witch, die. Please drop a potion. I honestly thought it did for a second there. Bob, leave me alone. Um, Lucky fishing rod, don't want. Chickens and diamonds, want very much. So, well, that was the romantic rose. Um, Obsidian, don't want. That stupid horse boss thing, I don't want. Saddles, don't want. Block of gold, yes, perfect. But I have no arrows. Um... Please, arrows. Spawn Did it honestly give me a spawn egg for one of the cows? I didn't know this thing worked with other mods. I don't want the magma cube, but look. Look, I have the spawn for the Halloween cow. Oh, dang, spoilers. Okay, don't shoot me. Actually, I do need arrows. I actually do need arrows. Um. Okay, guys, I'm just going to go and kill this thing, and I will... And actually, yeah, I'm finished opening Lucky Bucks, so I'm going to set everything up, and I'll get right back to you guys. Okay guys, I'm back. I finished um, gathering all my materials and such. I killed the zombie skeleton horse thingy and don't you know I didn't get a single arrow. So I'm going to actually make this trade, give that gold for that lovely power bow, but um, it makes no difference because I have no arrows. So maybe if by some stroke of luck the cow decides to drop um, arrows, I can use this. Um, also, I was able to make full diamond gear, so that's a plus, but I'm actually going to have to fight with this axe today. So, um, GG. <laughs> um, I don't think you guys understand just how powerful this fire cow is. So, I'm going to kill the first one with the unlucky potion. Oh, yeah, another two, um, additionals for this thing. Um, not only does this thing not drop any items, it also doesn't drop any experience points. So, you're probably asking, what the heck do you even need this thing for? But, um, just to fight cool bosses. Yeah, that's basically it. 
So, without further ado, let us begin fighting the Fire Castle. As you can see, 100 health, and when I hit it, it only does t I only do 2 to 3 damage to it. This is why I needed a better weapon. And he lights me on fire, so I'm just going to unlucky potion you right now. And, um, that only actually did... 24 damage to him, so he's actually still tanking more. Am I really gonna die on this first round? I'm gonna make it three rounds, th three lives today, because I know there's no way I'm gonna win against this thing. Oh, yeah, and I don't even think it's a normal fire tick either. Just saying. Well, yeah, it took one unlucky potion, and things just halfway down right now. You know, I'm just gonna beast mode it. Go. Die. Die, Cal. Die, Cal. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, let's be rational here, Cal. It's you or me. It's you or. I guess it was me. Okay, that was re that was um, one life. Let's go. Oh my gosh, look at all those potion effects on that unlucky potion was beastly. Oh no, wait, I forgot. I forgot to mention he has a finishing move that's gonna strike lightning and destroy the entire world. Give it a few seconds. Yeah. Um. Actually, this one blew up into the sky, but he broke my arena. He broke my. What's happening to me? Did I just get set on fire from invisible? Oh, there's the XP. Never mind. Strike that. For all you people who watch the mod review, I did I really just die twice in one round? Oh, the fire was invisible. Well, forget what they say. It does drop a lot of experience. I mean, I'm at 12 levels now, and I was at 2, so I gained 10 levels. But, I mean, he makes the fire invisible. That's not fair. That's not fair. But I'm going to count that anyway. So, I have one life left, and I have to, I'm just going to find another one of these because there's no way I can fight two. But just for the fun of it, one, two. Let's go, cows. Oh, yeah, if they're different elements, they will fight each other, so... I was kind of actually hoping if they were from the same element they'd fight each other, but... Okay, so I'm literally just going to have to do this the entire time. Just three damage is nothing. And I have tested this being with, like... If I had, like, a sharpness five sword, I would only do, like, six damage to these guys. That's how strong these things are. And the worst part is these things spawn naturally in your world. They don't even, like, have any conditions. They just are like they are right now. They just walk up to you and start beating the living crap out of you. And, I mean, they're cows. I mean, yes, I know, we do eat the cows in Minecraft, but that's besides the point. These cows are evil because they don't even drop meat. They should drop, like, some special, like, meat, depending on their element, like, fire meat or something. Or maybe, like, the hot, like, their leather can actually be, like, different element. I don't know, I'm just giving suggestions to the mod creator at this point. But, um, anyways, mod creator, if you're out there right now, this is a really amazing mod. Your cows are magnificent, it's just they're extremely hard to kill. Maybe make it easier to kill them? Because, I mean, come on, look at this. And I have to keep running to him. Am I actually going to kill these things? Is my Okay, nope, nope. They got one hit on me. I'm done. It's over. The fire tick will be too strong because this fire tick, I think, lasts longer than normal fire tick. I'm not entirely sure on that, but... Okay, yeah, it's not going to be below four, below four hearts worth of damage. Yeah, this is not normal fire. Did I just walk in that fire? I don't think I did. Is it really going to kill me? No, it's not. Okay, so I'm just going to run for a little bit and eat a cooked fish. If I didn't have this fish, I would have died on round one. Oh my god, these things are fast. These aren't even- this isn't like normal walking either. At least I don't think it is. I think they're running at the same speed I am. Yeah, look, I can't burn them because they're fire cows. But I might actually manage to kill them if I keep this up. See, this is ridiculous. The fact that, like, they're keeping up with me moves it says that they're- Moo. Moves. Now I'm talking like them. It proves that I'm a little- like, they're a little bit quicker than me. Which is bad. Come on, come on, come on. Maybe I can get a crit. Crit? Nope, nope, nope. Oh, I almost walked in that wall there. The one's all, the one's in 35 health, the other one's at 46, so I got this. They're almost dead, and I apologize for the boringness of this, but I honestly can't just jump in there with full diamond gear on. I'm still useless. And I'm pretty sure if this diamond gear had, like, protection 5, I still would be useless. So, yeah, this is what life is when you fight cows from the Elemental Cows mod. Um, there's my last raw fish. Let's just get it. Okay. Oh, I hit them both, but I literally, if I didn't hit them both, the one would, ah, oh, I just walked in the fire. Well, I guess this is it for me. Yep, this is it. This is the end of the cow round, guys. Yep. Dead. I couldn't even make it past round two. That's how strong these things are. But hey, at least we have more bosses to fight now. I plan on fighting all the different elemental cows, and I think I need either more trades or more lucky. Where are they going? More lucky blocks. Are they killing the, oh my gosh, they're killing the innocent. Did he just heal? They no. heal from killing other things. No. Yeah, I forgot to mention, they kind of, like, hate everything. Reminds me of Ore Spawn, but, um... Yeah, these these cows will attack everything, included, not including themselves. Like, they won't attack another... Fire cows won't attack fire cows, but, like, if there was another elemental cow... Like, for example, let me just, let me just get a cow real quick. Like, this lightning cow, for example. If I just spawned him in, like... 
Look at this, look. They immediately will start fighting each other. Just look at that. That's how, like, savage, savage these things are. Like, they, they want to destroy all life in the universe. But anyway, guys, um, if you enjoyed this epic Lucky Block battle against a cow, please hit that like button. Subscribe for more epic Lucky Block battles like this. And if you have any preferences to what I should fight next time, please, um put in the comments if you don't care then don't put anything but anyway thank you guys for watching and i will see you next time